there is nothing like the sounds of your own neighborhood. Go away, SpongeBob. You're polluting my thinking space. Trying to steal the Krabby Patty formula again, eh, Plankton? Well, you won't get away with it. I've got bigger fish to fry. I've got to figure out how to regain control of the chum bucket from those robots. Where did they come from? Where? Um, I don't know. Not for me, though, that's for sure. They just showed up out of nowhere and started calling me rude names and throwing things. They even bent all my spoons. I love those spoons like they were my children. That's terrible. Oh, won't you help me stop them before they bend all my forks? Not the forks! Of course I'll help. But wait, I'm supposed to collect a whole lot of golden spatulas. Golden spatulas, eh? SpongeBob, if you can get me back into the chum bucket, I'll give you a bucket full of golden spatulas. In your dreams. You've got a deal. Ah, the rolling green hills of jellyfish fields. A place to experience nature at its most raw and sometimes a bit tender from the stings. Squidward, are you okay? No, I'm not okay, you barnacle head. Do I look like I'm okay? Well, your nose does look pretty big. I mean, bigger than usual because it's usually pretty big. And you look clammy. And oh my gosh, you're bald! I've always been bald, but now I'm stung all over. Well, according to the Jellyfisher Field Manual, severe jellyfish stings can be treated effectively by applying a thick layer of King Jellyfish Jelly to the affected areas. <laughs> King j j jellyfish Well, I guess you're off to scale Sport Mountain and die a horrible death under the vicious tentacles of King Jellyfish. <laughs> I'll stay here. Bald up here in excruciating pain. You do that! Don't worry, Squidward! I'll bring back that King Jellyfish jelly for you to rub all over yourself. We can't jellyfish today. I'm going fishing for robots. Just my size. I love opening presents. like a spring breeze.
just met the Sponginator. Opening presents. Satisfying. Push, 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 push. Ah! Wow, Mermaid Man, I have all your comics and toys and mail. Hey, huh? W what? Oh, yeah, it's that sponge kid. And now, what was I supposed to tell you? That Patrick is surrounded by robots and needs my help. Huh? Oh, no. I think it had something to do with massaging my feet. Well, if massaging your feet will save Patrick, then massage I must. Help! They're making me hit myself! Massaging your feet isn't working. I think I'd better try a more direct approach. By clipping my toenails? Come, Patrick! That was a ton of fun! I 
should do it again sometime. SpongeBob. Whew. Thank goodness you're safe, Patrick. Well, of course, SpongeBob. Why wouldn't I be? Well, the robots and the... Oh, yeah, I found this for you. I don't know what it is, but it looks important. Thanks, Patrick. I tell you what, all that running around has left me pooped. Why don't you continue on for a bit? Okay. Oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. goes boom. Hey, you barnacle head! Watch where you're going! The rock is talking to me. Almighty oh, rock, I am at your command! Down here, you big pink lummox! Oh, hi there, Mr. Plankton. Are you going to vaporize me today? So very tempting. Unfortunately, I found myself in the undesirable position of having to assist you. I was in an undesirable position yesterday, and now my neck hurts. Heed my words, my large future minion. Go into Jellyfish Cave. Follow the instructions on the signs that you see. At the end of the caves, you'll still be a big pink idiot, but you'll know enough to help defeat the robots and get me back into the chum bucket. Well, then will you vaporize me? I might spare your life so I can force you to work in my sweatshop, making low-quality design and knockoff wallets. Oh, thank you. Bob's underwear fits quite right. Oh, why is a whistle?
present in every one. Uh oh, that's much better. Ouch. Uh oh, I don't think SpongeBob's underwear fits quite right. Been lonely out there all alone. <laughs> the robot go boo. I will crush them. SpongeBob's underwear fits quite right. Ouch. Ahoy there! Squidward tells me you're looking for the King Jellyfish. Yes. Good thing, too. That monster has been stinging all my good customers in their poop decks. I hear that you can find him up top of Old Sport Mountain here. Go hook that beast, sailor! Oh boy, Mr. Krabs. I'll see what I can do. Much better. Hello, Mrs. Puff. Hello, Patrick. I've got a job for you to do. Oh, boy. I found a golden spatula, but those robots out on the island stole it and threw it into the lake. If you can figure out how to get it back, you're welcome to it. Show sure enough, Mrs. Puff.
How many of these do I have to carry? Much better. Oh, don't look down, Patrick. Don't look down. Ah, I look. SpongeBob's underwear fits quite right. Uh-oh, this one goes boom. to help out today. Step quietly there. That king jellyfish is just up at the top of this path. Good luck. You'll need it. Thanks, Bubble Buddy. I feel like a new sponge. I knew the king jellyfish was big, but who knew he had such a beautiful voice? <laughs> I love 
have opening presents. Problem. You can do anything you set your mind and your muscle to. Oh, yeah. Oh, that feels so much better. Anything for my best friend Squidward. Can I rub some on? Um, uh, what if I just gave you this? 